Welcome everyone, it's Vapor to Dracomar. It is time. <sighs> Breaching Bronze 3. Yeah. Breaching Bronze 3 is so unlikely. It's not even funny. Like, what I'm gonna have to do to get there is enough to make most players absolutely puke. Oh, most game players are going to absolutely hurl from attempting it. Okay, can we uh, actually get some decent damage on these suckers? This is some Doom Tower level of BS, I can tell you that right now. Alright, we got the set up into the Valley of Death. Literally, I have to make a setup for this is That's the annoying part I hate it. wow that's actually a lot of damage That is actually hella damage what? At least that gets rid of some of them. Okay. I might have to kill the apothecary. All right, now it's time for the evil dragon of doom. This is the highest dragon I have ever fought and successfully won against. After that termite got away. Well, it didn't get away. After I slayed the termite, what am I saying? Well, I guess it was for the greater good. Because Elhane's supposed to be the damage dealer anyway. Or Dark Elhane. It's the sacrificial... The sacrificial Virgus. But still fighting this thing's going to be AIDS. Look at that. Look how much debuffs and BS it's doing to us. Like this, this is peak dragon fighting right here. Wait, why is it weak? Well, it's going to be a solo fight, and it's going to be a close solo fight at that. And the only way I'm able to do this is because of the War Master procs. Literally because I jumped 800 gems into this thing. And even then, I still don't know if I'll be able to... Wow, it charges it up quick! You see how fast it charges that? And that decrease attack is brutal. Wow. Okay. Yeah. It's like one mistake or something will ruin you on that difficulty. Ah. <sighs> Because I think I've beaten it once, and that was it. It's nearly impossible to do without, like, you know, a rank 6 Fergus, which is something I'm still attempting to do, by the way. 
Don't want anyone to think otherwise. Trying to increase attack so that everyone can, like, actually hit it for something. For some reason, Void Affinity is better for me than Magic Affinity. I don't know why, but, you know, it makes things better. Also, when the dragon is not, like, you know, hitting me for an Imperial... Like, the waves! The waves alone! Hit me for an unbelievable amount. Trying to increase its defense. The Dragon Mania. Shoot it. Whack it. Like, I'll take the level 120 dragon. It's just, I don't think I can. This is what I mean. This is how advanced this dragon is. It just killed Vergus, which is why he needs... He needs that upgrade rank, man. He really does. How I'm gonna give it to him is 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 tough to say, but he definitely needs it. All right. Upgrading artifacts for these people is going to be a nightmare. I've got an idea. And it's a sinister as hell idea. But it might just work. So what I do... Is I go like that, right? I upgrade his rank. I upgrade this guy's rank. With the faction, I'm not going to go with anyway. And then, 
from there, we upgrade her rank. And we put someone else in there. And then, you see where I'm going with this, right? Move that. You don't need her. You already have the Dark Elhaim. And then, when all is said and done, we should have what we need. Because this is what I'm trying to do. Take her out. We got that, that, and her. We take her. Or him. Turn him into that. And then, you see where we're going with this? We're going to take him out.
Put Deacon in instead. That's right. We are going to make history. Yes, for a very specific reason. Upgrade a spirit champion to rank six. Here we are. The vampire rank has been achieved for Virgus. It is done. There we go, guys. I finally achieved my second ever rank six. And we still need to develop these guys. Um, but yeah, let's see how he does. First time ever doing this, of doing another champion, uh, a defense champion at that. He takes reduced damage. I can already notice it. But yes. Um, I mean, I don't think you can necessarily save him because he's too weak right now. But it's done. We made a rank six Vergus. Granted, it involves sacrificing Sniper, but yeah. And Abyssal, but uh, we don't really need Abyssal anyway. Because Abyssal was never really that useful. Hell yeah, though. This is the first time ever doing this. It's the first time ascending ascending him to vampire status there he is I like how it shows it for both of him. Now to upgrade his masteries as well. Wait, I can give him a banner now. Possibly. I can give him a banner. So yes, 50k silver, not bad. Create a magic force, fully ascend to rank six. That's going to be difficult. But yes, it has been done. The crazy champion has been created. The vampire. All right. This feels weird. Feels weird that I have a level 8, but I know for a fact that he's one of the elite. 
on my team. He is like the the elite, the two most elite. By far. Well, the Virgus has been forged. Granted, it was very difficult to do. A lot of bad, terrible, like amazing decisions had to be made to do it. A lot of crazy decisions. It's very hard to sacrifice enough to make a rank six. It really is. But I can't. I can't um, do the other things straight away either. But yep, I got him to rank six, guys. It actually happened. It actually happened. The Miracle Debuff Remover. I can't believe I did it, though. I actually forged the champion that I wanted. I forged the rank six, guys. <laughs> you guys are like, when, he, when is he going to forge it? When is he going to forge it? Tonight. Tonight is the night I has forged the guardian. The evil guardian. Tonight is the night. That I forged it. This is him, the evil guardian. See? And look how much more durable he is. Look at that. We haven't even got him the max level yet. And then when I get the masteries on him, ooh, that's going to be juicy. The vampire forge it versus the dragon. There we go. The vampire has been forged. Now, what does the vampire require?
clearing of my core team. All right, guys. This is part of the true destiny battle of this. We'll even include Gallic. Oh yes. This was phenomenally difficult to get. Yep. Wow, he still got destroyed by that. Okay. Ah, oh, nuts. Can we get him to survive? That's the real question. The amount of damage he's going to take from that. Okay, at least I can spread it like that. A valley of death, the whole squad. Got him to live. Hell yeah, we do.